welcome to an intriguing episode of A Journey in Time, the podcast that unravels the mysteries of our past. I'm your host for this episode, Ellie, and today we embark on an extraordinary journey into the mysterious world of the Maya civilization. Get ready to delve into the curious question that has baffled historians and archaeologists for centuries. What happened to the Maya civilization? The Maya, known for their amazing education, advanced astronomical knowledge and confusing counting system, thrived in Central America for over two millennia. But then something unfathomable occurred. Almost 90% of the population vanished in 900 AD, leaving behind a world of unanswered questions. Join us as we explore the most likely reasons for the Maya disappearance, explaining different theories that have captivated the minds of researchers across the globe. Get ready to embark on an intellectual adventure that will change your understanding of history and ignite your imagination. Now, our history experts will reveal four intriguing possibilities. First up, we have Bo, who will explore the impact of deforestation and drought on the Maya civilization. Did these ecological factors play a part in their decline? In ancient times, there was a remarkable civilization known as the Maya, boasting around 15 million residents. They were well known for their skilled building. However, when building their magnificent structures, they had chopped down acres of trees at a time, which didn't do so well for the planet, causing deforestation, which led to not enough resources to build houses or start fires. As you can imagine, this created many problems, leading to many of the civilization to die. This was then made worse by a great drought which knocked the Maya off their feet only a century after deforestation. For around 800 years, there was a large shortage of crops, which caused even more more problems. With both events happening almost simultaneously, the once huge population of Maya had decreased to around 1.5 million. This tragic occurrence emphasises the importance of preserving our environment and its resources to avoid such dire consequences. Next, Layla will take us into the realm of disease and explore the idea that a deadly virus could have swept through the Maya population, reshaping their destiny forever. Today I'm here to tell you about how the Mayans possibly died. There are lots of theories. One of these, one of these theories is that disease killed 90% of the Mayan population. In the 1500s, the Spanish invaded the Mayan people, killing a lot of their population due to warfare. However, the Spanish people also brought with them diseases that were not found in North or South America, such as smallpox, measles and the flu, as well as malaria. The Mayan people had no natural resistance against these diseases, and because of this, the chances of surviving these were very low. They spread through... They spread throughout the Mayan settlements very quickly as the Spanish moved across their land and the death rate was very high. These Mayans did not have the medical knowledge to stop the spread of diseases and due to the Spanish, they are now in American continents. However, 600 years before the arrival of the Spanish, 10 times more Mayans perished. Could this have also been a virus? It seemed more likely because of their ease to catch a disease. A huge virus could have wiped out 90% of the Maya. Now, we have Lenny, who will investigate the possibility of a devastating natural disaster that wrecked the Maya cities beyond repair, altering the course of their civilization. Natural disasters. Natural disasters could have been the reason why the Mayan civilization could have been wiped out. Firstly, it could have been a tsunami because near to the equator, there was many underwater volcanoes that was active at the time. Moreover, it could have been a volcanic volcanic eruption because there was an active volcano called Ilopango in the Mayan area at the time. Now it is dormant. Finally a tornado because tornado because tornadoes can come across quite often in the Mesoamerica. This is why most historians believe that was a natural disaster. Finally, we have Aidan, our alien expert, who will delve into the captivating theory that extraterrestrial life could have played a role in the Maya's vanishing act. People believe that aliens abducted 90% of the Maya. People also say that aliens helped the Maya build the pyramid. Could the aliens that helped build the pyramid to betray the, the Maya people? Also, people, people also say that aliens helped Egyptians build the pyramids there. So, thank you for listening. 
and I hope you enjoyed this episode of A Journey in Time. In the space of a few minutes, we have, we have embarked on an extraordinary journey into the intriguing puzzle of the Maya civilization's disappearance. Stay tuned, fellow time travellers. Goodbye. Today's historians have been Bo, Layla, Lenny and Aidan, and me, Ellie.